Hi, it's the Rawsome Vegan Gal here, and I've got some great new products, actually four of different ones, from a company called Natural Sins. And I want to thank Juliet from the company for getting these products to me. Actually, I found this company at the um, Natural Product Expo West in Anaheim. That was um, earlier this month in month of March. So I'll be doing some other great videos with new products that I found there as well. So this they call the Unpotato Chip. And I'm going to be telling you more about them. There's four different flavors. There's pineapple, there's mango, there's beet, and also there is coconut. So I'm first going to tell you a little bit about this company and the products, and I'm actually going to try them. I've actually tried them at the show, and they are pretty amazing. I only have two ingredients in them. So, first to tell you, these products are gluten-free, vegan, they're OU kosher, GMO-free, they're baked, not fried or freeze-dried, there's no artificial color, flavor, or preservatives, it's all natural, fat-free, high in their dietary fiber, zero sodium, low calories, tree nut-free, and one bag equals one fruit portion. So that's got a lot of really good stuff in it. So... Uh, all it has is the uh, ingredient, which is either pineapple, beet, mango, and coconut, and raw cane sugar. It's also non-GMO certified, if I didn't mention that. And they're actually made in Costa Rica. So that's really interesting. So uh, let's see what else I can tell you on here um, about the product that I didn't tell you already. Uh, so it says here uh, they take two ingredients. Um, and they're doing things for us to steal a few potato chip fans along the way. We, they start with hand-picked Pacific Crest mangoes, volcanic-grown pineapples, mountain-sprouted beets, and wild coconuts. Then they hand-slice the fruits and veggies, paper-thin. I don't know how they do it. It's pretty amazing. I'll show you what they look like. And they bake them up to a crispy perfection so they crunch like a chip without a crumb of regret, which is definitely true. Once you try our very unpotato chip snack, we're betting it won't be your last. So that's, that's their little thing here that they have in their brochure. So now I'm going to take out each bag and uh, tell you. So this is their, first I'm going to do their fruit. Let's see, I'm going to first do their, um, this is their crispy coconut chips. And they all come in a one ounce size bag. And I like the bag, it's really pretty. And what else they tell you in here is, here it says, we crave crispy, crunchy, but what comes along Generally qualifies as junk food, but not this crispy, crunchy wild coconuts from Costa Rica. Hand selected, sliced, and baked right in our home country. As a snack or with a meal or tasty, very unpotatoed chip change. Uh, so let's see what else I can tell you. Um, it says 168 calories in one bag, 32 grams of fiber, and no sodium. It's also high in potassium, high in iron, actually 7% iron in this bag, 4% protein. It's got 32% dietary fiber. That's pretty amazing. Uh, this one does have more fat because it's coconut. So I'm going to open up this bag. Actually, I have a scissor. You can tear it. It has a tear tab and also has a resealable uh, as well. It's a resealable bag. But I'm going to just cut it here so I don't mess it up. And sometimes you tear it and it doesn't tear properly. So I like to cut it too as well. So now I'm going to open this one up. And to show you what it looks like, amazing how thin they are. So this is the coconut. So this they slice. Oh, and it smells so good just opening up the bag. So this one they slice like this. Look how thin that is. It's pretty amazing. Now, it tastes really good. And as far as sugar content, not that much. Only four grams for this whole bag. So that's nice. It does have that coconut, that coconut taste that you, if you like coconut, it's really good. Okay, the next one I am going to try is the mango. So now the mango, it says, um, you've eaten dried mangoes, but you've never tasted a Costa Rican grown mango sliced so thin you can almost see through it. Um, so that's, that's that one. It says, uh, baked until it's crispy, crunchy, and okay, craveable. This one only has 92 calories, 20% fiber, no fat, because again, all the coconut one has fat. Um, it's got 13 grams of sugar. Um, I think that's a little more than the other one. What is it? The mango, um, I mean the coconut one, say, um, only four grams. I guess this is because mango is higher in sugar. Even though it has the, the cane sugar, it's more from the mangoes. Uh, let's see. Anything else to tell you? Everything else is not as much. So I'm going to cut this one and show you what it looks like. And again, pretty package. That's the package. So they show you a picture of a mango and then having it sliced. 
Just like here with the coconut, how they make slices out of it. I think that's really pretty. Nice packaging. Colorful too, I like colorful. So let me cut this one open and try some of those. And oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, I will have a link below this video to their website so that you can check it all out where you can buy these products. So now I'm gonna show you what the mango, ooh, these are pretty. Smells heavenly too. Okay, so that's the mango. Look at the, they said you could see through it, just about. That's really pretty, look at that. And they leave the skin on too. You can see that little piece of skin there? Oh wow, that's really good. Then it doesn't taste like overly sweet, even though mangoes themselves are sweet, so it's more from that. I don't even know if it needs the cane sugar, it's actually so sweet. Okay, now the next one I'm gonna try is the, um, the pineapple. Again, here's the lovely package. And it says here, have you ever eaten a whole pineapple core rind at all? No way. You say, yes way, we say, because when we slice Costa Rican pineapples down to the millimeter, bake them low and slow, you get the perfect slice of the whole gorgeous fruit. So they use everything. That's pretty amazing. They, they don't leave anything out. So this one's got 98 calories for the bag, 15% dietary fiber, 17 grams of sugar again. Mostly the sugar is from the pineapple, the cane, I don't know how much they use. Uh, let's see what else to tell you. Everything else, not that much, and a little bit of iron. Um, potassium, dietary fiber. So I'm going to cut this one and try them out as well. I mean, I, like I said, I tried them at the show, but um, it's different here really trying them. And, and there they only gave out little very tiny pieces. So now I can really tell. Tastes amazing. What a great snack. This is great for your kids to take to school. Again, this is not perishable. So great for hiking, camping, go on an airplane trip or road trip, anywhere. Okay, so this is beautiful. I got to show you this. Wow. Here's the whole piece of the pineapple, everything, like they say, the skin and all. Look how gorgeous that is. It's like art. It's, it's nature, art, nature art, you know, in, in its true whole form. So I'm going to have one of these. Mm. Definitely, these are amazing. I really like pineapple. And yes... This would be better for most people than potato chips because they use oil. There's no oil in it. Wow. That one is amazing. I mean, I like the others too, but it's such a good flavor. Oh my gosh. Um, and then they have one final one to do, if I can find it. And that would be the beets. Again, beautiful packaging. Look at that. So it says, beets are so good for you, but chips are so good tasting. What's a snacker to do? Eat the best of both. They start with Costa Rican grown. Mountain beets sliced nearly paper thin and baked into crispy perfection. Tastes yum, all the, all the crunch of a potato chip without the crumb of regret. I like that. 100 calories, 21% dietary fiber, 10% potassium. It's got, this one has more iron, 6% iron, 4% uh, protein, about 13 grams of sugar. It's again high in dietary fiber as well. So I'm going to cut this one open and let you know how I think. So far, they're all amazing. I think pineapple so far is my, hands down, my favorite. I'll show you how beautiful these look. Oh, wow, again, they use the skin and all. Again, they don't take it, oh, is this gorgeous. Okay, this, this is a picture. Let me just try to find one that's really, really whole and not cut away. Some of them are, you know, they, they're very fragile, they break easily. Oh, here's, try to find like an absolutely perfect one. This is almost perfect, but I wanna show it to you on both sides. Look at that side. And then look at that side. Is that amazing? I think you don't even maybe even need the cane sugar. Another option would be there's other sugars you could use, like date sugar or coconut sugar. That's just my, my thought. So I'm going to try this one. Mm. Wow. Amazing. And I guess, who knows, maybe in the future they will do other um, fruits or vegetables because the sky's the limit with what you can do and especially the tropical fruits that they have in Costa Rica. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna go through the products again that I have here that I tasted. And they're all amazing. So I had the uh, coconut crisps. I said say chips, I'm just calling them crisp. Co crispy coconut chips. <laughs> and then I tried the crispy mango chips. And then I tried the crispy pineapple chips. 
And finally, the crispy beet chips. And I think, like I said, hands it down, I think my favorite was the pineapple, I think then the beet, then the mango, and then the coconut. They're all amazing. Oh my gosh. And I hope they do more, more types of um, uh, chips like this, because this is a great alternative, like potato chips. And uh, that's why they call it the unpotato chip, but how they get them so thin, I don't know. It must be a trade secret or something, but it's amazing. So I hope you will definitely check out these products. You will love them. And I thank you for watching. It's the Rossum Vegan Gal.